Hi, this is David Keith, the President and CEO of McAllister Regional Health Center. Just thought I'd uh, give you another monthly update and talk to you about the upcoming holiday season. You know, it's, it's, it's a time of year where we all celebrate life and we come together as, with family and friends and we enjoy the holidays and we commune together, we, we, we share food with each other. And it's the time of year that I'd like to share with you some of the good things here at McAllister. As you know, I'm very proud of the employees that work here and they work hard, but we're always solving problems, treating the, the sick. We're dealing with some very, very difficult times in people's lives. And so now I'd like to share with you some of the uh, stories that come to me that are full of joy and are positive. And I just wanted to share that with you. I've got some letters that I just had to read to you to share with you their experiences and how important they feel to me when I read them. First one's from uh, a gentleman, an elderly gentleman. My wife's visit was by far the best experience our family has ever had at McAllister Regional Health Center. This visit she had was good. There was exceptional care. And I want to reach out and congratulate Ken Sparks, our nurse, who went above and beyond during her visit. He took the extra time and care needed for my wife. So here's clearly a gentleman that used to use our services and has compared our services today versus how it was. And he's seen incredible improvements in how we care for our patients, how we treat them, and how we comfort them. This was a letter from a visitor to our emergency department. So I rolled into McAllister, Oklahoma while having a heart attack. I met the nicest people from the ER, from admissions all the way through to my discharge. These individuals told me what was happening at the time and what I would feel during the entire experience. I felt like I was in very good hands. McAllister Regional Center is the nicest hospital I've ever been in, and by far has the best people working here. I just happened to be at the right place at the right time. I do believe the outcome would not have been the same had I been treated elsewhere. Well, I'm happy for this gentleman. Obviously, we saved his life, and he's joyed that he's alive today with his family and friends. We receive letters daily. And instead of focusing on the negative, I've decided for the balance of my year, I'm gonna focus on the positive. I have one more letter to tell you about. This came from the daughter of an elderly woman who spent a week in our hospital after coming to our emergency room. My mother is almost 83 years of age and other than a really bad back is in excellent health. This was her first non-scheduled hospital stay, which is remarkable for a woman of her age. All the nurses and staff we had contact were all very kind and professional. We would like to give special accolades to Clarissa Hagmar and Jenilyn Young from McAllister, a CNA, a nursing assistant. They went over and above their call of duty and treated my mom as if she were their own. If the world had more like these two ladies, it would be a kinder place for sure. My mom spent a week there and is home recovering nicely. We pray that her health holds up and that she will not have to return you to your facility. But if we do, I trust we will have the same care and compassion. You know, again, we have such good employees and they are so dedicated and they're so caring. It's been a culture change for the last five years at McAllister. If you have anything you would like to tell me, good or bad, please write to me or call me. I'm available to listen. Thank you very much.